How about we cut the pack, huh? Welcome to Creator Card Performance and Tutorial. This is my version of a trick called Futurity Boy, David Jonathan. And I will leave a link down below in the description box to his channel. Go and check him out. He's got some great tricks on there. The trick for two is on the market by Alakazam Magic. But like I said, this is my version and I call it Creator Card. Okay. Cards are cut. I just like to show the cards are nicely mixed up and in no particular order. And I'll just remove these two jobs because we'll be needing those in a minute. I'm just going to show you that the, um, the backs of the cards are nicely mixed up as well in no particular order. I'm just going to show you some of these back designs, they're all totally different. Thought that was the same but now it's different they're all different okay all different back designs there like so right you can perform this with two spectators so you get the first spectator to shake the door to get a random number. And we've got number six. And just make a note here what the first spectator got. As long as I can remember that you don't have to do this, but this is just for this purpose. Okay, so we deal out six cards. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we stick this joke here, here, because that's going to create the value. Okay, we'll just drop them on top. Like so. You say spectator number two, I'd like to shake the dice. Dice. Now I've got ten. So I'll just write ten here. Like so. We'll count out ten cards. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And put this joker in, that will create the suit. And I'm just going to spread the cards out and show you where the two marker jokers are. And we've got one here. And the other one's here. Like so. So I've got a value, and we've got the suit. So we've got the seven of spades. Okay. On the back of this prediction envelope, create a card. It says the combined title will land on the back design. So we need to create a back design now. We've got the value, and we've got different back designs in here. So the best way to do that and get a random number is to add these two freely chosen numbers together which is 16. So we'll just deal out 16 cards. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. And we'll just place that there in a minute. So I've got the 7 of spades and the back design which is this card here. Now, wouldn't it be totally amazing if this prediction card in here matches the back design and the chosen value and suit? The seven of spades and the same back design. Thank you for watching. Welcome to the tutorial for Creator Card. But before I get on with the tutorial, like promised, I've got a few shout outs to do. And here they are Robert Ball Magician. Got a great channel, got some mind boggling tricks on there. Please go and check him out. Mickey Duffy, you asked me to reveal this trick, and that's what I'm doing now. I'm going to reveal it to you. 
he hasn't got a channel well he has got a channel but he doesn't upload any tricks okay but he might do in the near future this is a newbie starting out it's um the card trickster he does card tricks and, and reveals please go and check him out he'd like a bit of your love and support okay now down to the reveal what you'll need is you'll need a rainbow deck of cards these are the ones by magic makers and the cheapest place i've seen at the moment is walmart it's about nine dollars so if you live in america it's a bargain but unfortunately for us brits it's going to cost us about twenty dollars plus plus postage okay so or there is other sites on ebay what do their own decks but it's nice to get one of these because the faces the more bicycle and all the faces are the same index and pips okay so the setup is i'll take two red jokers from a standard red bicycle and i write uh, value and suit on here now this may look a bit like John Bannon's collusion. Now, when I first came up with this, I didn't, I've got to be honest, I didn't know nothing about John Bannon's collusion at all. But I did see um, the Magic Corner perform a version of it, and it is very similar to that. But in all honesty, I haven't stole it from there because I didn't even know about that trick till uh, Magic Corner uploaded it. And uh, I will put a link down below to Magic Corner's channel as well. He's got a great channel as well for you to check out. So anyway, I'm on with the tutorial. You need two red jokers, value and suit on. You also need from another bicycle deck um, a different design with the uh, created card basically the card you're going to force okay so you need that I'll charge the seven of spades you'll also need one in the deck as well for when you create the back design which if I can find it now where I've put it should be down here right there okay that's to create the back design in a minute so you just drop this inside there like so and that will be the created card the one you force so you have these two on the top halfway down the deck you'll need another red bicycle card any one I'll use the queen of diamonds I think this one actually comes with the rainbow deck I'll put that halfway down and third of the way down you need that back design card yeah I'm using the king of diamonds but remember remove the king of diamonds from this rainbow deck if you use the king of diamonds after that you need a seven the value and after that you'll need a spade any spade okay and I place these three cards about a third of the way down the deck at the bottom of the deck a third from the bottom it's got to be in this order spade value back design okay I hope that's clear now what I do I bend cut the deck there and have the queen of diamonds on the top and I bend the deck like that and like that so now you can cut the deck creating the illusion you're using the red deck so you take the cards out of the box like so so I'm going to cut the deck like so then you say I'm going to show that the cards are completely mixed up in no particular order but a bit better than that you'll remove the two jokers flip the cards over like so and they'll be amazed that all the backs of the cards are different designs 
Then the next bit, you just show them that the cards, the back designs, are all totally different. Till you get to your marker card, which mine is the Bulldog Squeezer back. There's the back design card. There's your seven of diamonds, your seven value, that's got to be on the bottom, your bulldog squeezer. Then I drop these down and just show them the rest and drop them on top. So here's the situation now. Spade on the top, seven and back design. The rest is self working. You get them to shake the die. And they have shook 11. Let's Google this one out. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. You stick the value down. 7 on top. Get the second spectator. They've shook 12. 12. This is all self working. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Stick the suit in, drop that on top. Spread the cards. Pull this one out, which is, you know, is the suit. You pull this one out, which you know is the value. Close the deck up. Flip these over, and you've got the seven of spades. Now you need to create the back design. You add the two together, 23. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, and twenty-three. And now you can flip this one over. So you've got the seven of spades with this back design. And there you go. And I hope that's clear. Now we'll put a link down below in the description box to my original um, creator card, which was really done as a demonstration for, for me to send to Alakazam, which nothing come of it. And I also sent it to Penguin Magic, but they said I could upload it as a download but that I don't know how that would work because that means I'd have to buy loads of these to sell to people and pass it to them and I couldn't afford to do that I was hoping that somebody was going to help fund it for me a big magic company if you like like Alakazam but I'll say nothing come of it and uh, I'll also leave links down below in the description box to all these channels here where I gave a shout out to Thank you for watching.